We humans have such potential for love, caring about other humans, caring about other animals. We have such potential for that. But we, but we unfortunately seem to coddle and promote the things that coddle our hate. And I used to look at the internet as being just such this amazingly positive thing. But there are so many parts of the internet that are just not that way. Hate builds on hate builds on hate. And there are so many places that people hate other people on the internet. There are so many places on the internet that show how misanthropic we can be. And for the people that are, the people who are not very social, or might even be antisocial, they still end up being social in internet settings. And we end up really treating each other like crap over it. We, we grow so far apart because of the internet, even though we're in contact with more people than we ever could have possibly been before. We're able to talk with people across the globe as if they're right next door. And yet, you see two people, or several people, they're all together, but instead of having a discussion, we're staring at these. Now I know that that might be just considered some old cliche and it's like, oh well, you're, it's like when uh, newspapers first came out and people were staring at the newspapers. It's, no, it's not. People think that we're having really, really decent conversations and that we're making so much of a difference and that we're doing so much good with these things. But we're not. I mean, it has the potential to. But the reality is, we're not. We're not using these things to the positive potential they can have. We're certainly not spreading love with this stuff. There's already so much hate everywhere. There's so much negativity everywhere that it's, it's difficult to bring people together on something positive. We can become positive if a tragedy happens. We can come together then. But why does it have to be that way? The internet is an amazing thing. We have information at our fingertips that we just was only made of dreams previously. But we also have misinformation, disinformation, and hate. And it's not like we could legislate at something and suddenly have that all change. Legislation isn't the answer to this. I just think this sort of thing needs to be talked about more. 
You know, I, I think we should go back to some of the values that we had in the late 60s that we were trying to shove forth in the late 60s of love can make a difference. Love is the answer and as cheesy and cliche and stupid as it sounds. It really is something we need to focus on more. We have the potential for so much empathy. We have the potential for so much understanding. We have such potential. But we just kind of throw it away. To do things that temporarily feel good and then later feel like shit. But then we ignore that it feels like shit and keep doing it. It's like a drug. It's like doing some sort of recreational drug and ignoring any of the bad things about it. We're only seeing one side of the double-edged sword of the internet. I hope we can get out of this. I don't know what more to say.